on the other side so that you can get that side set put the in the middle of the uh, marker in the middle of it and push down there there we go now we're on our way down do the same thing all the way down for all the sails yes Yeah, they, yeah, they're fitting nice and tight. And that's what we want. Well, now, guess what? They're leaving us to guess on this one. So we can guess. This one is right here, so that won't be too bad. And then this one is right here, which is good. And this one is right there, which is good. Now, as you can see, what we have left are these. You, they do get turned around in shipping, so make sure you check <laughs> double check that your mast support loops get untwisted because you have to pull hard and bring them down onto the hull support which I'll move my finger so that you can see the little vinyl support goes right down over next to the Cross support. And we do the same thing on the other side. We'll pull this and it's very tight, so don't be afraid to pull on it. You'll hear a little snapping now and then, but don't worry about that. That's just everything falling into place. Yeah, there's two sides. One side, the front. Now we'll go to the back, and we'll do the same thing on the back side. Tie the mask down. That one went in real good. Now this one's going to be a little tough, I can see. So what you do a lot of the times is you just pull down on the crossbar and it just slips right in like that, making it a lot easier for you. And then you check it and these basically fell right into place fairly even. And I'll double check them all. Make sure they're even and that they're all set in place. They look it. And that concludes the fabrication of what is known as the ghost ship. It's a beautiful ship. Beautiful kite. Some people use it as actually a flying kite. And some people use it as a display, as you can see. We have one on display that is lovely to look at all the time. This one we are going to be taking outdoors in a little bit as it's a nice windy day because these ship kites require a large amount of wind. Uh, unlike regular kites. Most of your regular kites are oh, anywhere from 6 to 7 to 18 miles an hour. These are going to take at least 16 to 20 miles an hour winds. 
because of the way that they are made. So, happy sailing. This is Admiral Nelson saying thank you for watching and hope you enjoyed the instructional assembly of the beautiful pure white ghost ship. Thank you. Good day.